film, you know, Almost Christmas, it has heart, soul, comedy, ensemble cast. Mm -hmm. At its core, though, what is the message that you want to communicate, that you want audiences to walk away with from the film? Well, I, I, I want audiences, and, and, I, and I can speak for, I think I can speak for my sister here, mm -hmm. Monique, as well. We want audiences to see themselves and enjoy themselves yes. and to love themselves and fi find the celebration in themselves mm. in this moment. Mo Monique has it, it expressed here during our interviews today that, that there's a new way in which her family looks at holidays, that every day is a holiday, that every day is Christmas, every day is a celebration. And I, and I just, I want to I wanna see that and feel that because there's, there's really instructive parts of this, this movie that sometimes you miss with all the laughter and all that, you miss all there. The, the kind of, uh, the sibling, the, the finding, the, the healing between two sisters, you know, or finding uh, uh, your son making an ethical choice. I love that. He makes an ethical choice. Yes. And right there on principle and everything else. So he's a politician. And all, we know we, we all have the, the, the thinking about politician. But I think that's what we want to see, you know. And we want to carry. The, the two, we had two scenes with the great. Look here, I'm mean saying, you about to say great. We ain't nothing. The great Gladys Knight. Thank you. Yes. Great Gladys Knight with two C's in there, you know. Yes. And, and every time I was running, by the time I get to, you know, I remember what I was saying, you know. But but that's 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 what we want to think. Okay. Yes. Yes. So, Monique, you killed it. <laughs> I mean, every single time you and JB hit the screen, the audiences last night went crazy. Can you tell me what scenes took longer to shoot? Not because of production, but just because of the comedy and the shenanigans. <laughs> All of it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All of it. Um, I, I think that we were all professionals. So we got it done, you know. And again, when you are working with a legend, a living legend, and that's what Mr. Glover is to us. When you are working with that living legend, you don't want to mess around because you want to respect what you're in front of. So though we had a great time, we got it done because we wanted to make sure we reserved our legend. We didn't want to have him there all hours of the night. Let me tell you what he taught us was how to take a nap. <laughs> Baby, let me tell you something. <laughs> Mr. Glover taught us in cut <laughs> and action. So we were learning so much from this man in every scene, even in his silence. He was showing us, listen, baby, this is how you have longevity. And his humility on that set, everybody was baby. He walked in, come here, baby, hey, baby, hey. From the director down to the brother cleaning up. So to be in that type of energy, in that type of spirit, you couldn't go wrong. So that's what you're getting when you watch this film. You're watching the head of the body lead his family. And that's what you get. Awesome. And then my last question, what is it that you think when Aunt May hit the screen, you telling people like it is, and you cussing people out, what do you think the audiences are just going to love? Why do you think they're going to love Aunt May? Aunt May is real. Aunt May is you. Aunt May is me. Aunt May is Mr. Glover. Mm -hmm. Aunt May is that person that says, I'm thinking it, I'm going to say it. Most people mm -hmm. think it but they're too afraid to say it. Mm -hmm. So Aunt May is that person that you love for her to come around. You just hope it's not your turn to get it. <laughs> but you're grateful that you got it when everybody walk away and you be like, oh, she did tell me about that. Oh, so, you know, that's who she is. And she's that spicy word lady. She the one that the Christians be like, oh, here come Aunt May. But they wish they could say what Aunt May said, baby. Yes, that's who Aunt May is. All right, thank you. All thank right, you, thank my you, love. Thank you. Thank you.